I was always afraid of the dentist as a kid, but found that watching videos of the procedures really helped to remove my anxiety. I think if I just film myself pulling a few more of his teeth, I'll be all set for my next dental visit. I was in a rush to get to work when I accidentally hit a deer with my car. That's exactly what I'm going to tell the police if they start asking about the blood and glass. I used to hate the smell of burning rubber, but I've gotten used to it. At least it masks the smell of the bodies. My grandfather used to love to sneak up on me and scare me for a laugh, so I wanted to try it too. He looked pretty scared when the hammer hit him, and I did get a good laugh from it. I wanted to be festive this fall season, so I made a pumpkin pie. Pumpkin sure is an odd nickname for a girl. I had heard a story about maniacs putting razor blades into apples on Halloween. Talk about amateurs. The will to survive in humans is so strong that even if you cut off all your fingers, both feet, and have 80% of your body burned, you can still live for hours. I wonder what else I can do to this guy. I was told that the only way to get a dark entity to leave your house and go to someone else's was to tell that person about it. I am so sorry. Sometimes the best way to settle a bad argument with a friend is a nice long fishing expedition. Sooner or later, they're bound to fish him out of the water. I heard that if you count the seconds between the drop and the splash of an object down a well, you can tell how deep it is. If that's true, then I'm fairly confident they won't find her body down there for quite some time. Ah!